everyone. Hopefully everyone enjoyed that speed build. So this is the arena slash coliseum. You can call it whatever you want. It was supposed to be a coliseum, but during the live stream of me building it, um, we decided to not make it a kind of a coliseum because of what kind of events we're going to have. So this is on the Arc Survival modded series with Fizz, but it is built in entirely out of vanilla. And you can build this if you want and stuff. So, yeah, this took about mm, nine to ten hours, one day, one sitting of building it. So, feel free. You can go down below and you can click on the part one, part two. And also, I did some stuff at the end of the video off of the live stream and, and stuff. So, this is on the modded server, like I said, hosted by Nitrato. You can go check them out as well down below. Um, the reason the rock elementals is because they are kind of just guardians to protect it because I really don't want anything to be fucking with this because we do have an alpha plus mod and there is a dominus's gigas and, and there's a bunch of other shit that can destroy like stone so the rock elementals are just here to protect they're not tamed they're just spawned in to protect the the Coliseum the arena so but let's take a look so let me move him out of the way for the time being so, I not haven't decided yet if I want to build that tower. Um, I, just, I don't really know. I don't really know if I want to build or finish that tower or not. So, it's going to be up in the air. I'm going to just leave it there for now. But over here, this is the main entrance. And, oh, I just realized that, that piece of wood up there is broken. The hell? I don't even know how that happened. Anyways, so this base is located right about there. This is on the vanilla Arc Survival map. It is at 75 and 32. So the purpose of this arena is to basically, um, whoops, let me do that. The purpose of the arena is to host events for the server and to basically um, do other stuff and things with it. So it's like the main headquarters of the server and stuff. So it's pretty cool. So over here is the tower. And now this is for people that don't have any flyers, but you know, people can get flyers real quick. This is a place to store your flyers, pteranodons and stuff. And you can walk up this way up the stairs because you don't fall off with S plus, like you can't fall off. So you can just walk all the way up to get to the top floor. And here is the arena itself. Now this is pretty cool. But before we go over that, I want to show you the front of it a little bit. So the design and the shape and the aspect of it was kind of inspired by the Romans. Um, but, as you know, it's not a Colosseum. So there is no spectates. There is no, like, it, it could have, should have been made out of Adobe, but I kind of just went stone. Um, yeah, it's it's pretty cool. Um, over here, I might build another building in the front just to keep it a little bit nicer. But, um, but yeah, so, but here is the arena itself. It's very big. It's very big. We tested, um... We did test inside that you can actually fit a, a nice Giga. You can actually fit a Titan in here very nicely. It's it's nice. It's it's just a nice fit for an arena. It's very comfortable and it's gonna serve our purpose very well for when we do events and stuff. Which if you are a person on the server that has won a, a ticket on the server or a Patreon, you can feel free come over here, hang out. You can do whatever. All the doors are unlocked, so you. Sh you want to use it as a you know giant taming pen to drop something in feel free i don't i don't really care um it's a very nice arena we do have a behemoth gate on this side there is no ramps i forgot to put those those will be put soon and this is going to be used to import dinosaurs that have been people's tame dinos and stuff and it's pretty much just another um way to just get dinos in and out very quickly and easily um i did not fix the uh outside um, as you can tell, there's a bunch of little holes and stuff, so I need to still do that. But, uh, but yeah, the Behemoth Gate. Someone asked me, can you build a building that's as tall as the Behemoth Gate? Well, guess what? I have just built you a building that is as tall as a Behemoth Gate. And it looks fantastic. Now, to do this technique, you need to make sure that the Behemoth Gate it can fit snugly. I do have it snapped to two fence foundations down here, as you can tell. And what I did was... I placed the ceilings. If you watch the speed build, I think I did. I mostly got most, uh, mostly everything in, during the build on the speed build. Um, so hopefully I did that. But what you do to get a 
uh, stuff above that is you need to have a foundation on the ground, like right there, and then you need to place ceilings across on top of that, and then snap the behemoth gate because you'll have problems if you don't. You'll have problems that the behemoth gate will be, um, like it just won't be able, you won't be able to place it if you do it the other way. Like you won't be able to place the ceilings on top. So, um, but yeah, this is pretty cool. It's very nice. We do have, it is a modded server, so there is modded lights for it. Just because these turn on and off, they are called, what are these? It's with the S plus thing, I think. I don't remember. Oh, there we are. Um, multi lamps, and because we have Wi-Fi around, like it's literally wireless, uh, um, wireless power. So that's the only thing that happens. And also all the bulk stuff as well. Um, this is like a bulk torch. Let me see, what are you called again? These also turn on as well at night and stuff. So it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. So yeah, it's a very comfortable arena. So look forward to some videos maybe in the future or maybe some events. And uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. I guess I'll show you real quick what it looks like at nighttime. There we go. One turn on. There we go. There we go. Yeah, there we go. There we go. There we go. So yeah, nighttime view, very, very, very nice. I just did it enough lighting that it feels like what I can do for this is I can shut off all the um, lighting in the middle to make it very, very, very dark. Um, but the outside of it is lit, so we can use this for in for day and night um, arena battles and stuff. So it's pretty, pretty. I like this a lot. And also, I didn't mention up here as well on the top section. Um, and also, a lot of people were asking me, this is a mod. Um, no, this is not a mod. This is called Arc Commander. I've done a video on this in a couple videos, actually. Go check it out. It's a software that you can use with Arc to spawn things in. And this is what I use mostly on my videos. So I use it for admin stuff. You have all the admin commands and stuff. It's very, very cool. I will link the video down below because a lot of people were confused about it says no mods, but this is a mod. No, it's actually not because it's not actually installed it's installed on your computer and it's an overlay on your game it's pretty cool it's not a mod it's a software <laughs> clarifying that um but yeah so up top you can go all the way around and you can basically spectate it's not a bad spectate though it's pretty good i mean the only thing you can't do is see underneath like down there but like Mostly the actions are above anyways. So I might do, in the future though, I might do some um, extensions of the, uh, the ceilings out a little bit here and there on a couple areas. Um, but for now, we're, I'm just going to test it as it is. Um, so yeah, we'll see how that goes. We'll see how that goes. But anyways, ladies and gentlemen, that's it. Oh, there's the ceiling right there missing. Haha. -ha. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, that is it. And I'm about to die. I go to die? Oh no, I have emphasis stats. <laughs> uh, but anyways, ladies and gentlemen, that is it. If you guys liked the video, leave a thumbs up, like, share, comment. Tell me guys what you think about the Arena Coliseum. I think it's going to be amazing for events, and I can't wait to start testing it out. <laughs> uh, anyways, I love you all. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have anything else you want me to build, please put it in the comments down below, and I will write it on my list. I have a list of a bunch of things, and a lot of people ask me, can you build an arena? Slash Coliseum, and guess what? We have built one, and I think it's pretty dandy cool. So, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Love you all. I'll see you on the next one. Gobble gobble.